Hi hey guys, uh, my name is Steven Mugo and welcome to Kenyan Dog Lover Show which is uh, this platform is all about dogs and um, our social media platform may be Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, everything like a Kenyan Dog Lover so just search that Kenyan Dog Lover Show is about everything and you, if you want us to, if you want to contact us maybe for dog grooming services, for dog training services, for dog care services and everything to do with dogs, dogs accessories you can call 0791 and Utani Pigiasemu will talk more and uh, if you have anything to deal with your dog it may be consultation manze so this is to all uh, when you are in Gialeo welcome so much we welcome welcome on board and uh, we, we, we love visitors in this place and uh, may you feel at home and uh, also may you experience and learn more about dogs what is when big up manze kuwa wenye tu wamekuwa manze wame support from bafo manze and kwa wenye tu wamekuwa ki monitor the youtube channel channel tumekuwa tumekuwa maybe for like two years dormant and thank blue to god because tumeru kwa youtube channel yetu and this is our first video after a long time and uh, i want us to do a challenge i want us to fikish a thousand subscribers and from that to fikish a thousand subscribers i remember so a giveaway at that point maybe kutoka na bracelets na kutoka na t-shirt so maybe utakuwa mse mwenye ata win that giveaway so a secret to for you to win this giveaway when utakuwa mse wa mwisho kusubscribe na ifike 1000 alafu you screenshot that when to me mimi kwa youtube kwa whatsapp page yetu that is 0791263370 today's dog fact eh nimekuja kulan because nimeka na dog for a long time nimekuja kulan do you know when you have fingerprint yangu ya mkono the same same way, yangu yezi farana ya mtu mingine, the same same way, dogs po, iyo, iyo fingerprints za dogs po, hayezi farana ya mtu mingine. So that is our dog fact for today. Remember to subscribe, to share, and that's the notification bell in case you need a new content. And also, like the, 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 sit, 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 po. Again, it's me again, Steven Mugo Givenji, a dog uh, blogger, you can call me the dog lover. And uh, today's episode, to me, is a series where we are going to discuss about different types of dogs. And uh, today, we are going to privilege Japanese with the Japanese pits, which originated from Japan in 1930, 1930 to 1932. And uh, here is the dog. Uh, so, uh, point of correction, we are going to record in 1920. 1920 to 1930 something that is when the dog was created in Japan and later it it came to, to develop na in, in different countries and here we have a friend who is called Snow yeah, he, is, he she she is my dog and uh, sana and so today we are going to learn uh, this dog this dog we will start with the uh, what anapenda now what happened? So I'm going to give you five facts uh, the Japanese pit. One fact, the, this dog in two attached to your owner. So the way you own it, you can see it and you can see it and you That is to show that the dog is too attached to the owner. So that, the second fact is that the dog is prone to anxiety and, and uh, what desperation and everything attack. So if, if, you, are, if, if you are planning to, 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 to own a dog like this, you'd consider things like um, like maybe availability yako and everything and uh, because people people say that it is a family dog and so uh, okay manish a family dog in energy attention in energy everyone every uh, maybe somebody to when i like a walk for, for for some time and also attention and that fact this dog in that true story uh, the family dog uh, despite him or her being a family dog uh, she's a good dog or she's a good go dog for uh, apartments. Maybe when you apartment and you are searching for a dog where, especially a family dog, uh, in this concept, you have to a family dog. So if maybe if you are searching for a dog, a Japanese pit is a good dog for apartments because the way the way anakwanga, anakwanga attached to attached to the owner in in the apartments, anajoko adapt, uh, anajoko adapt life more easier because. 
if you if you make an idol gift from from here, maybe to Mombasa or maybe to someone who is going to Tanzania, the dog will adapt very fast. So if you're considering a dog where you need a dog for a family dog and a companion dog, Japanese pit is the is the, is, is, is the right dog. Guy. So if 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 you if 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 I would advise you, especially to those people when you you have small children and babies as per se. Uh, for now, I would not consider and I would not advise you to be a, a, a Japanese speech because this dog, the fourth fact in the Kwanga, this dog is a shape too much. And if you have maybe, if you have maybe a, 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 a child to family, it is not advisable because, uh, because of that far in his affect the performance of your child. So I would advise you to find a, maybe a, a speed switch in a, a short coat because this one is a long coat and a short coat. So I would advise you to a short coat and also if maybe you have it now, I would not advise you to dispose but I would advise you to be grooming the dog maybe regularly, maybe one time after two weeks, yeah, when you control that shedding and, and uh, I think I think it's a poor because uh, because in that in that fact, I want to market our, our 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 company, which is Kenyan Dog Lover Show. We have services, different services like dog grooming, dog training, dog handling, consultation. If you have an issue with your dog, dog veterinary, uh, that is veterinary services. We have uh, we deal with different types of dog. If you need a, 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 a maybe a specific type of dog, and you need it, we we can connect you with some people who we know they have. So, uh, in, in that, the reason why I was saying that it is because we offer dog grooming services. Tunakuja kwa your place and we do everything your dog needs. Maybe, maybe trimming, maybe, yeah, different things. Trimming, washing, brushing, uh, nail cutting. So, everything that deals with dog grooming, we deal with it. So, up on social media platform yet, the same, same number I give you is 7912-6370. You can use that number to call us and to talk to the Maybe your farm, maybe your, your place, maybe at your apartment. Uh, so, that, that is the reason why we are portable to every. We want to reach out to every person who loves dogs. Because what we say is Kenyan dog lovers is a whole community where, where we, we gather different types of dog farmers, dog handlers, dog trainers veterinary services, dog lovers, so so we want we want us to, to, to help each other. So yeah, about about shedding off, uh, there is a fact in, that, in, in shedding off, especially, especially spits. Spits, uh, they shed twice a year. And twice a year, that is to shed the undercoat, the undercoat, as, as you can see, the undercoat, this coat, this coat, the undercoat, to shed this undercoat, uh, the dog sheds uh, twice a year, that is, that is, uh, 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 when when your dog in a shed the the, the undercoat, uh, in that time maybe the time in that season in a shed, the dog sheds that far for three consecutive weeks. So that means that at that period, you need to be having your dog groomer regularly, maybe once a week, and you can laundry kwa nyumba, vacuum cleaning for the far. So there is two services. There is the services for the dog as per se, especially to those dogs who have Japanese feet. There is the services in Utunakuja Kufanya for the dog only. And also there is another services for doing now the whole house, yeah, everything to do with maybe the ile fa ameshed course, maybe for your coach, uh, seats, we, we do vacuum cleaning and everything. And also we do some few spraying for the fleas and everything. So the fifth fact and the last one, this dog is so clean. And when I mean when I mean so clean, I mean it is so clean because you know, if you grooming for like one one time after two weeks, so that means that the dog, like this one, the last time I, I, I groomed this dog, I can say it is now a week and a half. Yeah, a week and a half. I'm gonna maintain who I'm clean. So so that means that this dog, wana they are, they are clean. Let me tell you, they are clean. If you, are, if, if you want a dog, especially for companion to the ladies, if you, because the ladies na juangam na kwa this is the right dog to choose. And uh, in our market, is kokila pahali, so if you need a dog, you can you can, uh, you can leave a comment at the comment section. Itaku plug na mtunajua konazo, and also me have some few ones, so if you need a dog, I can help you. 
so that is that is to deal with our fun facts so eh nataka turudi kwa the, the characters of the dog the character of the dog eh, this dog ina kwanga more bigger than eh, the cousin in inaitwa pomeranian pomeranian breed of dog which is which is smaller than this one so this is a mature dog as per se venye unaiona this is a mature dog so the pomeranian ina kwanga dog kuliko huyu so yeah that is things that you should consider the second the, the, the second thing about this japanese pit it is because uh, this dog uh, in terms of obedience and training they are highly let me say let me say they are highly trainable they are highly trainable because uh, i think i think for the basics for the basics training which is sit stay stop in i don't think you need a you need a trainer akuja kufanya hiyo kazi especially if you have a japanese pit this dog inakuwa inakuwa easily to inakuwa highly let me say highly to be trained so like uyu ukimwambia because it is like let me say it is like a human being when you love someone eh unakuwa unakuwa highly unataka kumfundu you obey him or her you trust him or her and everything to do with, with, with maybe you, when you love someone about this dog as i have told you earlier ni kwa two attached two attached na owner no no two attached by the owner so uh, the reason why i'm telling you is because they are too attached uh, i think i think they will they will learn more faster they will, they will, they will obey you more faster and i remember that earlier there is there is a guy who asked me my friend Teddy alikuwa ananiuliza how can i train my dog basics because you have said you don't need a trainer to come and train the basics things like stop stay go sit uh, i think you need the first time una hitaji ku train your dog you need to start with appreciation maybe boiled boiled meat maybe there is a, some pallet, pellets where we use for training maybe anything that your dog loves and a caution your dog is okay it come chocolate the sweet things don't give don't give your dog so if you want to appreciate use use uh, maybe meat boiled meat pellets uh, biscuit I would not advise eh hey, vitu kama hizo special meat so after that uh, when you start training your dog you can train your dog by by appreciating maybe sit stay and appreciate as as the time goes you keep on feeding the appreciation so unaacha kuya appreciate sana by ukiambia sit ina inakuwa ni sit it is a, it is a unaifanya ikaeni kama it is mandatory for the dog to sit it, it, it doesn't need uh, to be appreciated so especially kwa training your dogs especially this one japanese pits it is highly trainable and uh, it is highly controllable yeah and it is a clean dog so that means that in your house you train about uh, about now you put kwa nyumba na fanya hizo vitu zingine kwa nyumba the dog will know this is my right place how to pata hii dog iki ikienda choki la pahali so itakuwa inaenda pahali pamoja so as a, as a way to learn about that me would advise you unatandika kitu where ikikuja ikienda choki hapo tomorrow in the in evening ah uh, in the in the morning una pick to that 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 me that play, that thing when you mat maybe mat ni uliko umetandika unaenda una dispose so they are let me say they are highly trainable they are highly trainable so Uh, another thing you need to consider and you need to know that this dog is accepted in in a African Kennel Club and and, and those other clubs in uh, the dogs but i remember the last time i checked the club in Asia allow it is the American Kennel Club they allow this dog because at some point they tend to crash with other dogs because of the breed so they I think they i don't know the reason why wame 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 i want you to me kwa awaje you register to the kennel club so i remember and I, i i promise you that guys we will come to discuss about kennel club african kennel club what you need to know what you need to do in the in, in, what what is what is what is needed for you to to register your dog in the kennel club and also wakiwa na wakiwa na maybe dog shows we will we will make sure to make fanya to inform na wende wone everything so we have some few pro- projects where we are working on and uh, but for now i would advise us we 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 we, 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 we keep in you keep in touch with us because right now we have started a series where we will be discussing different dog different types of dogs and leo 
majaliwa tumeanza na the Japanese speed and uh, it is so sad to say that we have come to the end of our video and uh, my producer today alikuwa ni to Vicky is my friend from a long time and is uh, anafanya a good job of production and i uh, uh, at the end of the video to touch the link and everything you need to know about him the social media platform and some few videos amicha papa na pale and yeah so to all the supporters who are support in, in, in subscription, in uh, viewership, in sharing the video, big up, manze God, our bless sana. And uh, I'm looking forward to do more and more by God's grace. Yeah, so to look at my And uh, I'm happy. I'm happy to. I'm happy to resume. I, I have missed you guys. I have missed you so much. So I want you. May I want you to leave a comment there. Unataka. I want the majority to win and due to public demand nataka iyo win. Which type of dog nataka to film in our next video? Leave in the comment section to be which which is the next dog. And also, if you have a friend who is doing or who is a dog lover, uneza yachia namba yake kwa apo kwa comment section, mpigie simu and we do some videos uh, to educate people about dogs, accessories, nutritionists and everything. So as 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 as, as the time goes, to cut different videos, and uh, I've been your your host, Steven Mugogidinji. <coughs> yeah, I've said uh, I'm a dog lover. <coughs> no, 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 no. I have said I'm a dog lover, and uh, yeah, I am passionate in dogs. And if you have everything you need to know about dogs, I can tell you. So thank you so much. May you have a nice time. Subscribe, share, touch the notification bell in case of everything. Follow our social media platform, which is which is in, uh, Twitter to call Kenyan Dog Lover Show, uh, Instagram page Kenyan Dog Lover Show, Instagram page is Imeshkana Kenyan Dog Lover Show, uh, Facebook account uh, Kenyan Dog Lover Show Imeachiliana, and our WhatsApp number which is zero seven nine one two six three seven two. Everything will be provided in our in our note in our description. Good. Thank you so much. Adios. May God bless you.